What is up, Flick fans, and welcome back to my channel. And this is my quick Netflix review for War Machine. We are here to build, to protect, to support the civilian population. To that end, we must avoid killing it at all costs. So War Machine, no, not that War Machine, is the brand new Netflix movie that stars Brad Pitt. First off, we are going to talk about The Good. So the movie is very ambitious and provides for some great visuals. The cinematography is top-notch and technically beautiful. I also think the score, while subtle, is very intriguing. It's also fantastically acted. I mean, Brad Pitt sucks you in eventually, and the supporting cast gives you literally everything they have. And now... But something else that I said, very ambitious, almost overly ambitious, and that's where the movie kind of falls apart for me. While the shots and acting may distract you, the plot finds every way it can to bring the movie down a notch. And the fact that I didn't even know where the movie was going in the first 45 minutes is not a good sign. And another huge problem I have with the movie is tone. It wants to be a satire at times, but tries to be deadly serious as well. War Machine just does not know what kind of movie it wants to be, and while I say it is a solid effort, it missed the mark for me. So I'm going to give War Machine a 50%. So thank you guys for watching this super short review. If you like this style, the smaller movies that I watch, maybe a Netflix movie or a smaller budget movie, or one that, you know, I just don't like as much as the others, I'm going to try to do the style. So let me know in the comments below if you like this quick review. You know, get to the point super quickly so you can see my score, even though really the score doesn't matter. Anyways, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and you guys are the absolute best. I'll catch you later.